Fans from all over the world are descending on Philadelphia this weekend. They will be here for WrestleMania 40. Events kick off tomorrow with the main event on Sunday at the link right in South Philadelphia. That's where we find Action News reporter Katie Catro live for us tonight. And Katie, you actually spoke with a huge wrestling favorite who happens to be a Hollywood star. Tell us more about this. <laughs> well, Gray, I'm going to let the fans speak on this one because this Hollywood star was met with some boos despite the majority of the city welcoming wrestlers with, of course, that brotherly love. That's Dwayne The Rock Johnson getting booed on center stage today at the WrestleMania 40 event at the Pennsylvania Convention Center. He showed up about two hours late, and the crowd, standing on their feet the whole time for his arrival, was ready for a smackdown. But he had a reason. However, some fans say they buy his excuse. He's The Rock. He's got important things to do. The Rock proved why he is the final boss and why he is the most electrifying man in sports entertainment today. Little fans like five-year-old Colson got to experience the entertainment of The Rock up close. We picked him out of the crowd, noticed his shirt that uh, he was born at WrestleMania uh, five years ago, literally at WrestleMania. We were doing meet and greets, and I was having contractions. Um, every five minutes, but in denial. Today kicked off WWE World at the Convention Center. The Philadelphia Convention and Visitors Bureau has seen stats indicating the four-day event could ring up more than $215 million for the city. I willingly spent $500 on a title belt, so I'll tell you that. The fan base for wrestling is just, it's growing like every day, so this is, this is cool to see. And the Super Bowl of wrestling will take place this weekend here at the link on both Saturday and Sunday. Reporting live in South Philadelphia, Katie Catro, Fraction News at 10 on PHL 17. Shari. Oh, yeah, he's a big deal. Glad to see him in Philadelphia, but he's talking a little smack. Okay, let's just be honest. All right, Katie, thanks.